Hi YouTube, I am back. Um, I was doing a pick a card and it was really good energy, but I decided to not go with it. I just, I'm not trying to be a pessimistic. It was like way too good to be true. And I felt like every pile was the same. And I've gotten that before, which I feel like it's possible because we're all in a collective energy but the one the one thing that does irk me is seeing somebody say all piles are the same no they're not that's why i pull cards in like in front of you um so i so one can stand out from the other okay but anyways i just wasn't feeling it so i'm gonna go ahead and just do all signs i just wasn't feeling it that's all so let's get started and see what's coming towards all of the signs here. We're going to go by Zodiac sign. So let's start with Aries. What's coming towards Aries? In love. Spying. Aries, someone's spying on you. <laughs> or are you spying on someone? Let's see. Gift. Yeah, someone here is spying on you. And they are wanting to gift you something maybe take you out on a date or something or go out invest invest in time money on you let's see what is this spine um i don't think i want this one let's see sorry spine for aries for lines Well, it's someone that you have still a very, very strong connection with. And this person wants to come towards you. They know that the ball is in their court. And they might be just spying on you. They know that they need to do something. They need. They know they need to come and offer you something. What's coming towards Aries with this air gift? Yep, told you. It's someone from the past here. They want to come back around, invest in this. I feel like it's more of an investment because it's a gift. You're actually putting in money. Look at that. The Queen and King of Cups. This person knows that the bull is in their court and they need to come back around if they're going to invest in you. I feel like you've already taken your, um, you've pulled your energy away and you're very invested in yourself. Um, so this person wants to come back around see the challenge is to communicate with you so and move forward with the eight of wands so we have fire i'm only using like five cards so yeah it really doesn't even matter the zodiac signs but we do have scorpio we have water gemini fire okay but anybody can embody water love okay so let's keep going What's coming towards Taurus and love? What's coming towards Taurus and love, Spirit Guides? Sorry, that was loud. What's coming towards Taurus and love? Twin flame, Taurus. Your twin flame is coming towards you. <laughs> Let's see. Home. What? And I shuffled. Um, this did come out together in a in a pick a pick a card. <laughs> the one I scratched out. <laughs> the one I trashed. <laughs> let's see. So Taurus. Let's see what is this twin flame. Okay, Taurus. So I'm seeing here maybe um, something secure, a union together. So, um, somebody that's been probably stuck on you i don't i don't feel like this is you but let's see maybe somebody here your twin flame is seeing things from a different perspective yep reuniting reconnecting they've been stuck on this give me more of this home maybe they're they're wanting to take things to the next level let's see we have the seven of wands 
there was some kind of blockage or someone here is standing their ground um let's say give me more of this seven of wands someone's standing their ground because they want something serious maybe give me more of this seven of wands yeah okay so somebody here there was someone here is acting a little too defensive where it's making either you or them may feel a little too um a sense of rejection here okay i feel like you've been waiting on something taurus or they could but this person is seeing you a lot more stable maybe you brought that sense of more stability in their life and now they're seeing that maybe it was a there is a missed oppor opportunity and they're wanting to come back around see aries got this but it was here so we have um scorpio here judgment somebody wanting this is a challenge is to revive something that is dead yeah so we have scorpio pisces water fire and water interesting so let's see let's keep going what's coming towards gemini what's coming towards gemini spirit guides give me some clear messages for gemini what's coming towards gemini Ooh. okay friendship gemini maybe you're spending time with friends talking to friends Ooh, have you been dealing with a karmic partner you both have turned your backs to each other you've had so much going on probably yeah fertility is at the bottom of the deck okay so the challenge is to change to start all over i feel like this was like your friend but you both have turned your backs on each other let's see I'm also seeing this as reconnection, maybe wanting to have fun again. And here we go again. Let's see, what is this friendship? Sorry, this turn on again. I don't know why. Okay, <laughs> let's see, what is this friendship? I don't know why it keeps turning on by itself. friendship are you having a party okay so you're seeing things from a different perspective you're trying to just have fun right now could be and but someone here is seeing you in this way like you're not even caring i'm getting um it's my party kind of thing and you're not invited <laughs> i don't know why i'm getting that let's see I feel like this person is seeing you is feel stuck because they're seeing you live your best life or something like that building your your own foundation on your own give me more of this karmic partner oh yeah see this person is seeing you i feel like this is the same person this person is seeing you be happy doing your own thing and it's driving them crazy they feel stuck yep what's at the bottom okay so i feel like you are doing your own thing you were probably the giver here and this person is having a hard time realizing something seeing things from a different perspective or maybe they're just seeing you um live your life creating your own foundation your own stability it's like i'll have fun on my own i'm good without you and they're stuck so yep that's what we have the earth we have earth pisces here fire leo yep that is what i have so let's keep going cancer Oh, yeah. What do we have for Cancer Spirit Islands? What's coming towards Cancer? Give me some clear messages for Cancer. Mm. 
Okay, change. There's change coming, Cancer. Mirroring. Okay, so you're most likely mirroring someone here. Let's see, what is this change for Cancer? Okay, so there is change here. I feel like there's been a lot of unexpressed um, feelings, thoughts or something. It's stressing you out, but it's coming to an end. We have the Nine of Swords. I feel like this change is come like is stressing you out. Somebody here hasn't been very upfront with you and it stresses you out. So you know that there needs to be some change. Well, there is some change coming towards you. Give me more of this mirroring. A lot of swords. This person has brought a lot of stress into your life. Okay. Wow. Okay, so I feel like whoever has done you wrong is the one. I'm not sure if you are investing in yourself. You're trying to find your independence. But I feel like they are also trying to change here, just like you are. If you're already on vibing this way, I feel like you're also putting in the time. <sighs> Mirroring. This person could be doing the same thing as well this person also probably came and really drained you emotionally or just drained you a lot of we have someone sneaking scheming someone that you've put in invested a lot of time in and you both probably have gone through almost the same thing maybe childhood you both connected somehow emotionally um it kind of seems like if you're vibing this way they're the ones that are stressed out and because i feel like you you went from stressing from becoming your own here now the mirroring it could be that maybe they know that they need a change they know that they need to also do something to find their independence something like that mm -hmm. they could also be thinking the same thing as you let's see wow there is a lot of stagnant energy but there's change coming in if you are working on yourself there's change coming in for you but i feel like this person is probably now stressed Oh, yeah, look at that. So many swords. What's going on? Maybe because you're changing. I'm feeling that someone here has been changing. They're finding their independence and they're the ones that are stressed. They're the ones that are maybe wanting to come back and change this with you. But to you, you're like, no, I'm working on myself. I'm done with this. Wow, a lot of air. That's what I'm feeling for some of you. So, there's change coming. Okay. Let's keep going. Let's see, Leo's. What's coming towards Leo's? What's coming towards Leo's? What's coming towards Leo's? celebration Ooh, I see a wedding fresh start okay so I feel like there is something coming into your life that's gonna give you a sense of a fresh beginning here a new beginning wow something happy like it's gonna make you happy let's see what is this celebration Oh, I have two. Okay, so the worst is over. The disappointments, everything. There's a transformation in your life, in your environment. It's happening. And I feel like there might be someone new coming into your life. Or somebody doesn't know how to express themselves to you. Oh, wow. Somebody is coming into your life. Could be a Pisces or a water sign here. Somebody that 
is um, you have a very strong connection with. I feel like both of you have grown and is are willing to, you're willing to put the past behind. Yeah, I feel like it's new, Leo. I feel like it's new. Hang on. Because I feel like you're getting attention from others. And you're going to find someone new coming in. And you're going to have a fresh start. You've changed. You're putting the past behind you. And you're just living your life. There is someone coming in that's going to make you happy. There's going to be sparks between you two. That's what I see. Leo. Could be old too, but I don't feel it. I feel um, like it's a new. Yeah. It's uh, someone taking you out, showing you interest, um, gestures, sweet gestures. So we have water, could be a Pisces, a Scorpio, more water, another Leo or fire sign. Someone's going to find you very attractive. Okay, so what's coming towards Virgos? What's coming towards Virgos? What's coming towards Virgos? Intimacy. Loyal. Wow. Someone's coming towards you. That's been... That is very loyal. Let's see what it is. Who it is. Intimacy. Give me some... This intimacy... Whoa, intimacy, yep, with the devil. There's going to be some intimacy between you two. <laughs> some, some lust here. Somebody bound. Somebody here is thinking a lot about this. Could be you. You could be thinking a lot about this. You're bound to someone through, you both have connected through intimacy and Ugh, someone's in their head about it though. Give me more of this loyal. I feel like this person still thinks about you both. So, I feel like someone here is wanting to come back and apologize. For some reason, I'm getting that. Yep, somebody wants to clear the air with you. They want to come towards you. Maybe move forward from this. I am getting someone wanting to clear the air with that. I know it's not the Six of Swords, but to me in this deck, it feels like it's been um, pretty rough. Maybe you have left a situation or you're very confident right now or they're seeing you this way. See, somebody left the situation. It's caused a lot of drain, emotionally a burden here, emotionally draining you and you've left but this person wants to come around and um apologize for something mm -hmm. i feel like you're still very connected to this person because you both have had amazing intimacy that's what i'm getting okay so i do see capricorn i see water i see air pisces cancer let's keep going Libra. What's coming towards Libra? Spirit? What's coming towards Libra? What's coming towards Libra? New perspective. You're seeing things from a different perspective. Oh, loyal again. Um, who, who was Virgo had that? Okay, why is new perspective here? You're seeing things from a different perspective. Maybe you've been loyal to a situation here. Let's see, Libras. Why is new perspective here? So yeah, something has come to an end. You're seeing things different now. Yep. 
you've learned from something something very very hurtful and there's a new beginning for you let's see give me more of this loyal for libra wow i feel like you've been loyal to a situation i feel like you're actually meeting someone new here somebody that's very loyal very giving very they're like your best friends this is going to be a new spiritual connection somebody that has grown also somebody that is determined to win you over something like that you're going to have a lot of passion chemistry with this person yeah i feel like you've closed out something here with the ten of swords and the world yep with a ten of wands i feel like you're finished with something from the past there is a new fresh energy coming through and it's bringing you someone new yep fire it could be a taurus aquarius leo scorpio air signs should be gemini water sign yep that is what i have let's keep going what's coming towards scorpios what's coming towards scorpios what's coming towards scorpios happiness Ooh. nostalgia Ooh. <laughs> um let's see what is this about maybe you're thinking about the happy times you were with someone or maybe the happy times because you're nostalgic maybe maybe someone else is let's see give me more of this happiness for scorpios what's this happiness for scorpios okay so you've just ended something a situation maybe oh okay someone's coming back around or maybe you're putting something to rest and you're happy about it you're getting a fresh sense mm, i don't think so <laughs> but let's see what is this judgment i feel like someone's coming back around you think you've ended something <sighs> you're leaving the past behind you you've left the past behind you scorpio would you leave because there is some nostalgia here let's see what's this it's nostalgia Ooh. why do i keep getting two of cups what's going on with this energy something's turning around something's turning back around someone's thinking a lot about this memories and they want to come back around yep i don't know if you cut this person off but they're thinking about a way of how to come back. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm seeing. It must have been you that took your, you pulled your energy back. But they're coming back. Okay. Maybe you don't want to give to the situation anymore. You're putting something behind you. But I feel like they're wanting to come back. They're, they're nostalgic over you. Yep. So we have Taurus. We have Water Scorpio. Could be a Leo taurus aquarius sag water libra okay so that's what i have let's keep going sagittarius let's see what we have for sagittarius spirit guides what is coming towards sag What's coming towards Sag? Promise. Secrets wanted to come out, but what's coming towards Sag? Extroverted. Extroverted. This is the first time that this has come up, come out for me. Well, not for me, but for for a reading <laughs> so we have promise someone here let's see what is this promise someone's giving you a promise what is this promise for Sagittarius S 
at home family somebody that you've made a promise with I feel like this is you maybe you're trying you're promising something or someone's promising to you emotional fulfillment someone's taking action towards you let's see give me more of this extroverted whoa okay could be a taurus strong taurus or aries but i feel like somebody here is um standing their ground standing their ground maybe they're out there as well this person is wanting to go out there get out there and maybe show you their side yeah there's some communication here regarding maybe going out doing something this is someone that's very extroverted i guess someone in your life and wants to talk about something serious with you but i don't know if you like that sanj you don't you're not you're not the type that sticks around or gets into something serious right away. Let's see. Give me more of this King of Wands. There's going to be talks about something. Yeah. I feel like there's going to be a new beginning here for you. Sagittarius. Someone's going to promise something to you. I feel like there is talks about something serious with this person. That's that. I feel like. You see them as somebody very communicative, very outgoing, very outspoken. That's what I'm seeing here. Very extroverted, of course. And someone's making a promise to you. Uh, maybe uh, talks about a higher level of commitment. We have the Hierophant too. Ten of Wands. You know, I feel like the challenge is to take responsibilities because i feel like you're not the type to be stuck in one spot so you kind of want a relationship that will just go with the flow of things i don't know that's what i kind of get you want to go with the flow of things or if you want something serious i feel like there's going to be talks about it but there has to be some kind of promise or a compromise or coming together and agreeing on something together so we have fire, Aries, Pisces, uh, could be another Sag or a Leo. Um, we have water, we have um, Taurus, Aries, Sag. Yep. I feel like you don't want that heavy of a, a burden. That's what I'm feeling. Anyways, let's keep going. Capricorn, what's coming towards Capricorn? What's coming towards Capricorns? What's coming towards Capricorns? Oh, so I just got that. Mm. I shuffled. Affection. Ooh, this makes more sense though. Okay, so there is going to be a promise here, maybe a higher level of commitment coming towards you. Someone that has a lot of affection for you. There's going to be some kind of compromise coming together, agreeing on something. What is this promise for Capricorns? So someone here has a vision for this. They, they have a vision. I feel like you're in that vision whoa but someone here is emotionally confused give me more this is also someone with the page of wands and the seven of cups this is someone that wants their i want to say they wants their cake and eat it too i feel like this person is confused they don't know what they want 
They want their options open. Tell me more of the Seven of Cups. Well, that changed real quick. So this person could be also confusing you because you thought that this was something that was going to go somewhere. And it didn't. Or it's not. Give me more of this affection for Capricorns. Yeah, there is some defensive, like somebody here is standing their ground, or maybe they're just kind of blocking this. Someone that, that has, um, yeah, they're blocking this. It's not you. Someone you thought, they kind of confused you because you thought you were going somewhere stable, secure, but that didn't happen. Someone you have a lot of affection for, and they had a lot of affection for you too. But there must be, there was probably some drama here. Okay. Bottom of the deck. So, clearing something, messaging, talking things over. Communication is a challenge here. But calm communication, clear communication, because there is some drama. Somebody here is blocking the other person, something like that. But you know what you want. You're standing your ground, I feel. And um, this person just comes around and kind of confuses you. They're also confused. They don't know what they want. But you really thought you, they were a little, they were very promising. They showed it to you. But that didn't happen. So what's coming towards you, I feel like there is still a message coming towards you. But it's going to confuse you. Mm -hmm. Because they don't want to get too close. And I feel like you do. Mm -hmm. You want clear communication too. Okay, so we have um, Earth. It could be another Earth sign, Fire, uh, Gemini, Water, Aries. That is what I have. Let's keep going. Okay. What's coming towards Aquarius, Spirit Guides? What's coming towards Aquarius? A fresh start. That makes sense with the... um transits we're having right now i feel like there is fresh starts for you you're going to be able to redeem yourself we have redemption or somebody here wants to redeem themselves we'll look let's see what do we have for aquarius what's going on with this fresh start Oh, wow. So you seem like, ooh, you're stressed. You're stressed about starting all over regarding some money, stability, security. Um, you're stressed over this. What is this redemption? Oh, but you're going to be able to redeem yourself like... Something here is coming that's going to bring you a sense of hap well celebration. You're going to feel happy. You're going to find your stability. I don't. You don't need to stress over this. You're going to be moving forward. There's going to be some kind of communication here that's going to make you happy. It could be from a fire sign or somebody very attractive. Or somebody that finds you very attractive. Could be also, I don't know why I'm getting it online. <laughs> Maybe because all the people here, maybe you're in the spotlight, but I feel like you're coming out of this okay. Okay, so I feel like you're going to come out of it okay. Mm -hmm. You're going to have the stability that you wish for. I feel like you are getting some kind of recognition or something here. It's making you um, the spotlight of some sort. You're getting recognized or people are wanting your attention yep with the queen of wands i mean the queen of um pentacles 
that's the challenge is to see your value okay i feel like you're just stressed over some kind of stability if you're not stressed it's somebody else stressed about you and you might not know this mm -hmm. but i see this as you yeah celebrating moving forward mm -hmm. like it's gonna turn around for you we have leo we have sag or just fire sign earth but yeah because you might not see this or someone's having nightmares over money something like that we have a uh, cancer pisces gemini or earth sign capricorn or air signs in general okay so that is what i have let's keep going last one pisces what do we have for pisces what's coming towards pisces what's coming towards pisces what's coming towards pisces decisions and options hmm life partner okay so i feel like you're going on dates for some reason this always reminds me of um when me and my significant other would go to um what is that place called it was pre-pandemic <laughs> um oh, i forgot it's like uh forgot what it was called i haven't gone because of the whole pandemic thing it's been closed down but you go and play a lot of games together it's for adults um and you win stuff and a life partner is coming i feel like you're you're having options you're going on dates or something let's see give me more on this decisions maybe you have a decision to make yep pisces that's you a wish fulfillment wow emotional fulfillment too i feel like you need to explore your options or also be a little selfish with who you give your energy to uh spend it with time friends fam with time with friends family but i feel like there's options for you you're needing to decide to be happy emotional fulfilled there is emotional fulfillment coming towards you a life partner give me more of this life partner for pisces a wish fulfillment coming towards you yep it's like your love life is turning around or something here you're hitting the jackpot we have the wheel of fortune yep somebody here somebody here wanting to come towards you and make you an offer but not knowing how and it is a soulmate could be a past life connection because i do get kind of that vibe here so someone from the past coming back around in the world there is some unfinished business here with someone could also still be past life um unfinished business you don't need to come um in this lifetime to finish it up or something like that but i feel like you have decisions maybe knowing you know being sure that this is a partner you want to be with life partner so we have a, you it could be a taurus aquarius leo scorpio another pisces um sag a scorpio okay so that is what i have thank you so much for watching and i'll be back later take care of you bye